Hey YouTube, welcome in to my first time playthrough. I'm Shenanigans, you can call me Shan, and this is what you can expect coming up in this episode. I'm gonna kill Peter. <gasps> um, oh, <gasps> oh, oh, Shepard. You just <gasps> cost me 20 years of my life. Are you joking? What, oh shoot. What's up YouTube, welcome back, or Welcome in. If this is your first time, welcome in. <laughs> if you've been here before, welcome back. This is my blind playthrough of Mass Effect 2. How are you guys doing today? I hope you guys are having the best days ever. I've been thinking a lot about last episode and I don't know. I have, I have a lot of thoughts. I mean, obviously, I think we've known from the beginning that the elusive man is a, like, just a real POS and a liar. It's it, it's very much feeling like a toxic relationship. I feel like they're trying to isolate her. Then there's that whole thing with Caden and I don't know. That's a real that's a real mind fuck cuz I get big emotions, you know? <laughs> like um I obviously feel things very deeply, so I could understand uh, Kaden having big emotions when we had our reunion, but I think he's a little bit on thin ice with Shepard right now. He definitely said some things that were not okay. He called her a traitor, and that is just not fair to her, and I get it, big emotions, so we're gonna let it slide. I'm hoping that somewhere down the line, there will be some kind of like, hey, I thought about this and I don't know, that, re that really didn't go the way I wanted it to. In my head, I think she's very, it's very loyal. She's devoted to those in her circle and she loves very deeply. But once you kind of like cross that line, she's done, she's out. There's like no more. And I don't think Kaden's necessarily there yet, but whew. <laughs> Yikes, you're on, you are definitely on thin ice, buddy. <laughs> but with all that said, I think today I'm gonna do a loyalty mission. Zaid has been waiting the longest. So I think, you know, cause he gave us his kind of like right off the bat, like Zaid and Kasumi. So I think that's what we're gonna do today. And let's get into it. <laughs> all right, uh, I think we're ready to help Zaid. Oh, no, we're not, cause we're gonna read. Okay, is it Zoria? Zoria. Mud, sweat, and spores is how Blue Sun's mercenaries characterize a planet that gave birth to their home office. This lush garden world is known for its heavy plant and fungal life, creating spectacular jungle zones over much of its eight continents. Oh, that's cool. Despite persistent problems with rot and rust, Zoria attracts investors and corporations from all throughout the galaxy since it has exploited only a fraction of its potential resources. The Blue Suns dominate... The Blue Suns dominate security contracts on Zoria so much that residents describe them less like a monopoly and more like a conquering regime. Oh, well that's interesting. We... Okay, we're just like constantly running into Blue Suns everywhere. I feel like these would, these two would be like a good pair. <laughs> Someone was like, um, Zaid is very much renegade and he is. Uh, so I feel like that is a good pair with, but it's also fun to sometimes pair up people who will call out bad decisions. But I'm going to, I think I'm going to do that to Jack. I'm going to take Jack to this. Also, <laughs> some of you guys are so funny in the comments. When I was talking to someone about Zaid being like renegade, I was like, it's okay, I can fix him. <laughs> and they wrote back in the comments, they wrote it out as Zaid would say it, like, God damn, God damns and da 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 da. And I heard it in my head and it had me cracking up, laughing so hard. I probably look so silly like giggling at my phone as I'm like reading the comment, but you know, just let me be delusional. Do I think I can fix him? No, he has probably been this way, a renegade for, I mean, much of his adult life, I'm assuming. So would he go with a Paragon Shep? 
no, but let me be delusional. Let me look past the red flags, okay? <laughs> His character design so much. I love Zayed. Someone was like, do you like facial scars? Obviously. I love this man's look. Look at him. I love it. Oh, what are those? Are those like, what? I, I want to see those up close. I want to see what those look like up close. Those like bird-like things. Tapping into Blue Sun's communications. Stay tight and look out for ambushes. Okay. Is this like... This is like a neat little place. I think the closest destination to something like this we had was like Vermeer, right? Ooh. Um, but that was more, I mean, I guess it was jungle, but it was also like a lot of water, like beach. Oh, a shuttle landed near your location. Check it out. Oh, okay. Here we go, keep close. Okay. Oh, <gasps> what the heck is that up there? What is that? Look at that. Oh my goodness, look at that! Aww. And like, is it a little monkey? Oh, I love it. Um, I feel like I gush about Zaid so much. And I was thinking, I was like, why? Oh, dead bodies. Shot in the back and left to rot. That's definitely Vito style. Oh, yeah. Let's push ahead. Okay. Like, why do I like him so much? Why do I like, ooh, look, another one. Those kind of like villainous personalities. And guys, I was like thinking, I've been this way my whole life. If you asked me as a kid who my favorite like Disney characters were, it's Ursula, number one. Ursula, always Ursula. It's always been Ursula, number one. Command to Bravo, ooh. take a position. Likely these people are not runaways. Runaways? And then number two is Scar. <laughs> like, this is legit. Like, anyone in my real life will tell you. I like looking for people to see if there's anything up here. And then I think, like, taking the number three spot, it's like all of Aladdin. So, like, Jafar, uh, Aladdin, and Jasmine. Ooh, what is that in there? Oh, it's a monkey. Report to base. Armed intruders incoming. Where? This other checkpoint. Where? Oh, <laughs> shoot, 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 shoot. Okay. Let's take cover. Oh gosh, I thought I was gonna jump in on accident. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I love Jack so much. I think she's so funny. Ah! Oh my goodness. Um, I need to reload. Oh, wait, did I see something move up there? Maybe it was just trees. Hell, got one. I can't get a good. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, dang, 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 dang. <gasps> I'm about to get my ass handed to me. I feel like it always takes me a minute to get back into combat. I mean, I don't know if I ever actually get back into combat. You know, I try really hard. <laughs> but wait, wait, what is that noise? <gasps> okay, there's more. Oh my God, no, the little, the little mech puppies. Oh shoot. I do try really hard though. All right, let's get this video. I went right over my head. Sit down. So are they gone? Oh, I guess I got them. Okay. Did we miss anything? Is there anything over here? Oh, well, there's a med kit. Hmm. All right, we go this way. Oh, walked right past that. <laughs> Whoopsie. I guess it just moves it. This hmm. is Commander Santiago. If any of you retreat while the intruders are still alive, I'll kill you myself. Now get the hell back out there. Vito. Sounds like he hasn't changed. I mean, we know he knows this guy, right? Like, he's... 
What? He's told us that. That feels like a weird... I don't know. That feels like a weird answer. Uh, I sound dangerous? Sounds like he needs oh. to be <laughs> Glad to see you and I agree. I knew he was a sadistic bastard back when we started the Blue Suns. The Suns only got meaner after he staged his Wait. coup 20 years ago. So, yeah, we have a past. What? You're joking. No. <gasps> you found it. Wait. Okay. 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 So, someone in the comments said, when you get to, when you start your bro shot playthrough, to do Zaid's mission, loyalty mission, before doing Garrus, because I guess there's some kind of like interaction with like the Blue Suns or whatever. And then they said, uh, you'll know why if you do this. Holy shit. I get it now. What do you mean he founded the Blue Suns? anyone tell me you found the blue sun yeah because it's not common <gasps> knowledge oh. Vito wiped me out of the records oh. he ran the books I led the men worked real well She's so for a pretty. While. look at her then Vito <laughs> decided to start hiring Batarians cheaper labor he said goddamn terrorists I said okay so 20 20 years 20 years is a long time to hold a grudge uh, a grudge I don't know Vito <laughs> turned my men against me he paid six of them to restrain me while he put a gun to my head oh and pulled my the trigger. Goodness. For 20 years, I've seen that bastard every time I closed my eyes, every time I sighted down on a target, every time I heard a gunshot. Oh. Don't you call that a goddamn grudge? Oh, Zaid, I'm that. I agree, it's not... I wouldn't call it a grudge. I am so sorry, I didn't know. Yikes. That shot in the... What did you survive? You survived a gunshot to the head? Yeah. And you survived your ship getting disintegrated. <gasps> a stubborn enough person can survive just about anything. Okay. Rage is a hell of an anesthetic. I hate that there's like... No more options after that. Um, that's uh, okay. Guess let's go. We better get yeah. moving. Oh, what a! You got shot in the head. Well, let's go. <laughs> God, that's so bad. Oh my God! All squads mess at the gatehouse now. They know we're here. Okay. Bring it on, you son of a bitch! I understand why this is so important to him. Wow, wait, wait, was that a gunshot? Was that, what was that? Hmm. Squad Charlie, Delta, mass on the gatehouse. It was like, to see if there's anybody up there. Why is there that seems silly? Why is there not? There when they have somebody posted up there. Is this a trap? <laughs> Are we walking into a trap? Because seriously, that seems like somewhere somebody would sit, right? And watch the door? That seems to make sense to me. Okay. Zaid Masani, you finally tracked me down. Vito. Don't be stupid, Zaid. I have a whole company of bloodthirsty bastards behind me, ready to kill or be killed on my command. Actually, take your shot. Give my men a reason to put you down like the mad dog you are. Again. He's just like... trying to aggravate him. What was that? Gone nearsighted old friend. Burn, you son of a bitch. <gasps> oh! Oh, okay. You just signed your death warrant, Masani. What's he doing? What the hell are you doing? Yeah, what are you doing?
Oh. Opening the gate. That was unnecessary. Explain yourself for me next time. I don't. I don't understand why that was bad. I mean, maybe if I say this, it'll explain why. <laughs> I don't know. That's so weird. We don't sacrifice lives for the sake of the mission. Oh, is she talking about our lives? Like what? Wandering out in the jungle for hours looking for another way in. You want to waste time out here? Go ahead. I'm gonna kill Peter. <gasps> um. Oh. <gasps> oh. Oh. Shepard. Endangering lives and the mission for your own selfish revenge. <gasps> You really want to do this, Shepard? I had enough. Oh no! Stop fighting! You, we have a burning refinery to save. Let these people burn. <gasps> There's people Be in the air. Oh, that's why. I don't know what I thought that was. I guess I just thought it was like a hideout. Since <laughs> I don't know. Oh man, 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 man. Um. Okay. I don't want them fighting. We can, I mean, also, yikes, yikes. Oh my gosh. So much. Hi, look what you did. Oh my goodness. He, oh shit. Okay. You have, <laughs> you've endangered everybody. Everybody. Dear, like, goodness, friend. What are you doing? Okay. Oh, let's get this. There had to have been another, well, I guess he wanted to just get to Vito as quickly as possible. And that's why I was going to say there had to be another way in. Trapped. We can't get to the gas valves to shut them off. The whole place is gonna blow. Oh my goodness. No time. Vito's probably halfway to the shuttle docks by now. You suggest we leave them? You're willing to watch these people die? Damn right I am. We stop to help these people oh and Vito goodness. gets away. And if he gets away, I'm blaming you. If I say this, will he leave? Does he leave? I mean, I'm not the, the Sinclair Shepherd. Sin Shepherd would never just let those people die. But I'll be sad if he leaves. We're here to free these people. We're going in. I knew this was a mistake. If we're gonna do this, we better get to it. Oh no. Gosh. Okay. Hmm. Work through the burning. Oh, shoot. I missed that. Let's see. Where do I need. To oh, shoot! Oh, there's stairs. I didn't even see those. Okay. So much, so much stuff, so much stuff. Okay. I could do without all of that. I could do without all of it. Okay. Shoot! Stop it. All right, I'm gonna stay on this side. Like, maybe if I stay away from the smoke. <laughs> Shoot! Oh my goodness, okay. Fuel control, redirect fuel. All right. Oh. Okay, there's another one. Oh my. Oh my goodness, I'm guessing those were workers. Generator pipe. <gasps> oh no. The extinguishing system upstairs. Upstairs. Okay. <gasps> oh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay. 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 Uh. 
Okay, we can do this. I said upstairs. Oh no, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Let's run. Wait, where is it? Let's see. Uh, oh shit. Where, where is it? Okay, maybe. Let's grab this really fast. I have goosebumps. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, okay. We can use this. Um. Oh, fire extinguisher systems. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Did that do it? Did that do it? Can they get out? If you don't, or Zaid move. I don't see them. Okay, I don't see them. Do we need to do maybe something in here? How do we? Wait, can? Okay, okay, okay. Okay, the door's open. All right, they. Okay, they're they they can get out. There more people? How do, I, how do I get down? Just jump? Okay. Oh wait, I'm stuck. Oh no, I'm stuck. Oh, okay, there we go. Anything move? I don't see anything back there. This should come in handy. Oh, I don't think I want to use it though. Nope. Listen, I'm a creature of habit. I just like what I like, okay? I just like what I like. <laughs> Wait, where? In here? Engaging hostiles! <laughs> oh, shoot! Oh, my goodness. Huh. Is there anything else in here? No. Wait. No. <sighs> scare the <gasps> That's Jack. Oh my gosh, it's scared the crap out of me. <laughs> okay. Anything up here? No, there's not. More than two. You brought <gasps> and you still oh, I can't take cover. Okay, there I am. What did he say? You brought Shepard? I took your life. Now I'm taking it again. Uh, I don't think so. Oh. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. That's not what I meant to do at all. Dang it. Anyone else? Oh. Barney concussive shot. Let that loser die, Shepard. You can walk out of here alive. Okay, well, I wouldn't do that. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> nah. Oh, shit. What's that back there? No. You should have come here, Zaid. Did you forget who you were dealing with? He's reload. Oh, I thought he was down. Ew. Oh, no. I need ammo. I need ammo. Oh, gosh. What is this? What is that? All right. Uh, I don't want that gun. Ah, shoot! Lock and load. What is... Oh, 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 no. Okay. Uh, how do I... Okay. Okay, okay, okay. The field tank's coming loose. Shoot it. What do you mean? What? Hell yeah. Field tank? Is that what he's talking about? <gasps> oh, that's how you. Barring concussive shot. I don't see what he's talking about. Okay. Let's reload. Ah, oh, shoot. Yep, it, it activated. Great. I love that for us. 
Where... Where are they? Okay. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. Yep. Oh my gosh, okay. Alright, I need to reload and take cover. <gasps> Not the best time for me to, to do that, huh? Okay, uh, take cover. Oh my goodness. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. Um, uh, what do I do? What do I do? Huh, huh. Oh no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna run up. Okay, I gotta get here. Like, let's see. I don't, okay. I don't see any more enemies. Me 20 years of my life. Are you joking? What? Oh, shoot. Ah, son of a bitch. Ah, oh. What? Oh, she is constantly getting, like, she's constantly having people pull weapons on her. Are you, like, who's supposed to be with her crew? You hurt? Is he okay? Said, you all right? The hell do you care? I'm fine. That's not fair. Now come on, get me out of this shit hole. I'm not gonna say I don't want you on my ship. I do want him on the ship. I just want him to not. I don't know. Not. It's not. I don't know. I don't. It's not that I don't want him to be the way he is. Maybe just like he's at kind of like a ten. Can we be at like a seven? Can we take it to a seven? Maybe. I'm not gonna say that. I'm. I'm not gonna say I don't want you on the ship. I'm gonna say. Why should I trust you? That's a good. You put your revenge ahead of the mission. How can I trust that you'll be there when we need you? I'm doing what I was gonna have paid to do, Shepard. Oh. Just don't expect any more than that. Now stop screwing around. Let's go. Well, I feel like we... I don't know. I don't know if there was a chance for us to be friends or not. You know, obviously, I know he's like a DLC character, so... But, if there was, I feel like we just lost it. And that sucks. That is unfortunate. <laughs> also, this sounds horrible. You brought this on yourself. <laughs> uh, but I have definitely learned that if there is uh, one of these choices, you should probably make them. I learned that in my bro, Chef Vermeer. That was bad, what happened in that episode. So we're not doing that again. We will not be doing that again. I sobbed because I didn't choose these kind of answers. Okay. You put your own goals ahead of the mission. That is not the way this works. I've survived this long watching my own back. No time to worry about anyone else. <gasps> Shepard, do not do that. You're part of a team now, Zaid. Shepard, no that is not okay. We're all working together. You, you have a point. I'm not done with Vito. But I can put that behind me long enough to get your mission done. Let's get the hell out of here. Okay, I didn't like that. I do expect her to be... Oh, what are we doing? <gasps> Wait, we're leaving? Did I save everybody? Did I get everybody out? Oh, no. Did I fail this mission? What if I... I saw two other doors. Oh, gosh. I thought that...
is what it is, I guess. Um, Eldfell Ashlyn Refinery on Zoria, 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 has been liberated, though the company will have to spend millions to rebuild. Although Vito Santiago escaped, Zaid has accepted Shepard's command and appears focused on the mission. Has accepted Shepard's command. That... I don't know. That doesn't necessarily feel like a positive. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> um, hmm. I don't love how that's written. I don't know. Ooh, Zaid power unlock. Okay, Inferno Grenade. Ooh, he has a new outfit. Nice, we can play Pixel Dress Up. <laughs> uh, let's see. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. I don't even know if I saved everybody. I really, dang it. But you know, that's what happens on blind playthroughs. Like, I'm just gonna miss stuff. It's gonna happen and we just have to accept that it's ha gonna happen because you don't know what you don't know, <laughs> you know? So Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Okay. I'll look at it in a second. I wanna go talk to Zaid and see if he has anything to say. You know, sometimes you don't know what you don't know. Sometimes I'm gonna miss some investigate options. I'm not always gonna pick the left hand if I don't want to. <laughs> you know, uh, I'm gonna miss doors and um, other, you know, items that might be around. It's just gonna happen and we just have to be okay with it. All right, let's see if he has anything to say. This mission takes me back. Hmm. <laughs> tough fight on horizon i fought slavers and kidnapping rings but nothing like that some slavers took a little girl on a colony in the skepsis system girl woke up fought her way out got picked up by my band well on her way to omega hmm. eight years old she'd have had no chance on horizon oh. hmm. jack subject <laughs> zero whatever you call her Oh, Hell of a girl. <laughs> Could have used a destructive little bitch like that <laughs> ten years ago when we dropped blind in the Krogan DMC. Took out a lot of Krogan that day, but we lost way too many men. Destructive little thing. <laughs> I should let you go. Oh. Talk more later, shall Okay. We? All right, we'll, we'll do one more garbage compactor. <laughs> All right. Um, since we're down here, we might as well see if... If Jack has anything to say, let's see, how do I... Through here, I I just get so turned around. I think it is, I think it's down these stairs. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. I got thoughts, like little bugs crawling in and out of my head. I can't stop them. Okay. You know I have a history with Cerberus. You know how far back it goes? No. But I'm listening. I'll listen to anything you have to say, Jack. Oh, that's a good answer. Your pal, the elusive man? We're not pals. Never seen him not before, pals. but Cerberus raised me. First thing I remember is my cell door in a Cerberus base. They did experiments, drugged me, tortured me. Whatever chance I had to be normal, they stole it by trying to turn me into some superbiotic. The doctors, the other kids, every one of them hated me. They let me suffer. That's right. She did say, I forgot. She said that they, they, they took her. They took her as a kid. I, I don't really, they kidnapped her. I'm not sure or, oh, but I know that I, I forgot. She told us that she'd been with him since she was a child. Justification for torture? I... What did they hope to gain by torturing a little girl? It was something about pain breaking down mental barriers and how it might clear the way for a more biotic power. Oh my god! I'm sure there was a payoff due at some point, but I wasn't gonna see it. I was wired up in a cell. This is a disgusting organization. Why are we here? Why can I not immediately storm into Miranda's office and be like, 
yo, this is so like fucked up. We're not doing this anymore. I'm uh, why. for no reason they tortured you just to see if they could make a strong biotic that's it of course they did wasn't it they're disgusting to ask shepherd oh all i know is a little girl crying in a cell begging for the pain to stop all i know is i want to fucking i want Very dark. I'm. You enjoy what you became. Fucking stop it. Who says that? Never. Um. Escape. How did you get out of there? There was some kind of emergency, and I made a break for it. The other kids came out of their cells and attacked me. So did the guards. I just killed everything in my way and ran. Guess my biotics had developed faster than they thought. I managed to get a shuttle off the ground. Drifted until a freighter picked me up. The crew used me, then sold me. That's my uplifting escape story. Wow, okay. She has been through so much. I literally want to fight everyone for her. I just want to, like, I... I'm not gonna get emotional. <laughs> uh, other kids? There were other children in the base? I didn't know much about them. I was kept separate. They hated me just like everyone else there. When I broke out, I had to fight through them all. I showed them, but there's a loose end I need to deal with. What does that mean? She had to fight through the other children as well? I think I, yeah. I hate that they're like, you're sure it was Cerberus. I mean, fuck, uh, obviously, obviously it was Cerberus. <laughs> like, why, why do I have to say that? Uh, but that's my only option. <laughs> you're absolutely certain that Cerberus was running the facility? I was a kid, but I wasn't dumb. I know how to listen. It was Cerberus. Don't care how far down the chain it was. Yeah. They thought they were so clever. Turns out, mess with someone's head enough and you can turn a scared kid into an all-powerful bitch. Fucking idiots. Ooh. Oh, ooh, Cerberus is different now. Sinclair Shepard, Sin Shepard would never say that. They are exactly who she thinks they are. That Thresher Mall, where you find the scientists in I mean, that that mission where you find the soldier and the scientist and you find out that they had been putting thresher maw acid in the veins of those people just for like just for fun experiments just to see what would happen oh my i'll confront them i'm going to talk to the elusive man and he'd better have some answers he'll just deny everything that. that's not what i'm after anyway i found the coordinates in your files I want to go to the Telton facility on Pragia, where they tortured and drugged me. I want to go to the center of the place, my cell. I want to deploy a big fucking bomb, and I want to watch from orbit when it goes. Okay. Okay. We can, yes. Um, just drawing servers. base. Attacking our allies is going to derail Oh my god, Trevor, shut Not a smart move. Shut up. That's not what I wanted to say. The files That's not what I wanted to shut say. down after my escape. It's been abandoned for years. They going to care if I blow up a garbage dump? That was a horrible, horrible thing to say. That would... I don't give a... Uh. Okay. Why, why now? I mean... I'm gonna assume it's because she now has kind of like the power and the ability and people around her that will help her do this, but we're gonna ask it anyway. <laughs> You've lived with this your whole life. Why do this now? Like I said, yeah. I found the coordinates in your files. You can't expect me to just sit on information like no. that. I don't. I don't expect you to do that. In fact, like, listen, we will... Yeah. 
fully understand why you would want to do that. Let's go. I'll set a course for Prague. Wait, do we have to go right now? Oh God, please. You, Shepherd. Oh, this is not like the Horizon mission. Okay, thank you. I was like, oh no. <laughs> I'm not ready for another mission. <laughs> oh, but poor. Oh, Jack. What are we going to do? That is... It's too much. How is she... She had to really... Oh my gosh. The amount of strength it takes to be on this ship, on a Cerberus ship with us, after everything she went through with them. Oh my gosh. Oh, Jack, I don't... I can't believe you did it. I don't know why you're here. Maybe... Maybe she saw something in Shepard and was like, maybe they'll help me. Oh, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, not gonna cry. Cannot keep doing this every episode. I wanna go one episode where I don't. That breaks my heart. Okay. Suck to Grant. Shepard. Wanna talk? Just checking in. Making sure you're acclimatizing. <laughs> I was just... <laughs> just sitting here thinking. The picture, huh? I'm finally starting to get it. There's a tank imprint. The battle at Canrum. A dead Turian. Stripped. You don't see them out of their armor much. A Krogan boot on his head. And a claw hammer. It's under the brow plate, pulling it back, right? Eyes have gone black, and you see tension in the muscle. You can feel it ready to snap. I get it. Okay, um... <laughs> Maybe I need context? Canrum isn't ringing yeah. a bell. Death of Shiagar, female warlord. Turians oh. killed her, so they were hunted down and made examples. Even if they won the war, it was the last push before the rebellions ended. Okay, uh... Why is that funny? Maybe I had to be there, but I don't get the joke. There's no joke. It's just great. It's a Turian, and he's being torn apart for what they did. Okay. I felt nothing before, but now I get it. It was a good fight. The enemy was destroyed to punish them all and send a message. I get it. <gasps> I Grunt! Turian. No, you don't! No! Grunt! No, you don't, Adrian. <laughs> Stop saying that. Oh my god. No, we're not like that on this ship. We we don't... Oh my gosh. Grunt. Oh. Child. What are we gonna do? I don't like hearing this. I don't know if I'll be coming <gasps> to these talks anymore. Oh, Shepard, you can't say that. <laughs> Whatever. Don't have to be friends to fight good enemies. No. Just thought you'd like to know I'm finding reasons for my own battles. Oh. Oh no. Oh, I How do we fix that? I don't I don't want that I I can't have that be a reason for your battle. <laughs> okay, buddy, we can't be we can't be doing all that. Oh my goodness. Okay. Grant, we can't be doing all that. I I got to figure out how to fix this. Oh my goodness, please don't make me dislike you. Please, 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 please don't do that. I would really... Oh, buddy. I don't know what to feel about Grunt. My psych reports were for Oak here. We have no guarantees that Grunt is mentally stable. I get the feeling he just doesn't care about anything, including who lives or dies. I mean, Kelly... <laughs> um... <laughs> I don't know how to feel about him either. I think we're on the same page. We're on the same page, friend. Um, I'll protect you. Don't worry, Kelly. I wouldn't mm -hmm. let him touch you. If there's any touching being <laughs> done, you'd better be involved. Anyway, what's up? <laughs> if there's any touching, you better be involved. Oh, Kelly, you make me blush. You're so funny. Uh, how's the crew? Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages at your private terminal. Anything else, Commander? Okay. That'll be all. 
I'll be here if you need anything. Can you help? From Robin Ree. Commander, the Alliance soldier here gave me this contact information. I hope this reaches you. You said you were trying to stop those collectors. They took my son and my brother. Have you found them? Do you know where they are? I know you're looking, but so many people are just gone. Every family lost someone. Is she on horizon? The children are the worst. Empty desks at school. Winter clothes that never got worn. Please, the Alliance isn't doing anything. Council isn't doing anything. If you can find our people, I'm begging you to do something. Tell me something I can do. Tell me anything. Robin Reed. See, this is the only reason that Sin, my femme chef, would continue on with this nonsense with Cerberus because, I mean, I guess we did see that at least they, they sent someone or they sent people to Horizon to kind of look into the colonies, but I don't think it's enough. It definitely isn't enough, right? The Alliance isn't doing anything. The Council isn't doing anything. I mean, I guess she probably does feel like that she, with the funding and backing of Cerberus, is the only one doing anything. And I guess that's the only way she's able to overlook all of the horrific things that they did and the lies that they're telling her and like using her loved ones as bait and putting them in harm's way. Like, oh, it's a lot. Okay, I wonder, is this... Hmm. I wonder if this, like, becomes a mission. Robin Ree, okay. About, hor about Horizon. Shepard. I'm sorry for what I said back on Horizon. I spent two years pulling myself together after you went down with the Normandy. It took me a long time to get over my guilt for surviving and move on. I'd finally let my friends talk me into going out for drinks with a doctor on the Citadel. Nothing serious but trying to let myself have a life again, you know? Then I saw you and everything pulled hard to port. You were standing in front of me, but you're with Cerberus. I guess I really don't, I guess I really don't know who either of us is anymore. Do you even remember that night before Ilos? That night meant everything to me. Maybe it meant as much to you, but a lot has changed in the last two years and I just can't put that aside. Please be careful. I've watched too many people close to me die. On Eden Prime, on Vermeer, on Horizon, on the Normandy. I couldn't bear it if I lost you again. You're still the woman I remember. I know you'll find a way to stop these collector attacks. But Cerberus is too dangerous to be trusted. Watch yourself. When things have settled down a little, maybe, I don't know, just take care, Hayden. day for Shepard. What a week she's having. Sees her lover, gets called a traitor. Now she gets dumped. <laughs> she, she just got a Dear John letter. I, yeah, I think that was like the, the final nail in the coffin, wasn't it? We're going to put that to rest, I guess. Wow. And I 
I don't know. I feel like it's a little... Like, homie, I get that you've moved on and everything, and that's great for you. I also spent two years dead, and maybe you might want to protect Shep's feelings just a tiny bit, just a tiny bit, just the tiniest bit, and not tell her about the dates you're going on. I don't know. I, maybe the letter could have done without that. I, I think it still would have been a great letter without that information. Oh, Shep. It's all right. It's okay. You know what? fine. She is a badass bitch. We just keep moving. We just keep going. We go one foot in front of the other. That is just one more thing that we're not thinking about and worrying about because we have other missions in front of us. All right, let's look at our journal. What do we have left? Okay. <gasps> Wait. Can we recruit Dolly? Oh my goodness! Why have I not looked at this before? Okay. Formerly listed as Talizor Naraya, the Korean engineer earned her adult name after helping Shepard defeat Saren two years ago. Tally is currently on a classified assignment for the Migrant Fleet Admiralty Board. Okay. Can we recruit? Okay, so maybe this went from like the shittiest day ever to maybe not the best day ever, but like it's up there. <laughs> I don't know, maybe that's what we do next. Oh, um, I feel like we have so much stuff though to do. That is so wonderful. I'm so excited. That makes me happy. She is so wonderful. I love Tali's personality. Okay. So yeah, I guess that Maybe that's what we do for next time. I, man, oh, I guess I could look at, hang on, how do I, the, cause you can, no, it's over here, isn't it? You can kind of see the team status, right? Oh, it does say loyal. It did say that, didn't it? Um, okay, that bit in the summary, it was kind of written in a way that I was like, unsure, that's, good okay so he is loyal but goodness also I am going to say that I don't love that Shepard pulled the gun on him I think there was probably like I, I wish I'd had a choice to not do that because I didn't like it when Rex did it and I think that me personally for this Shepard personally I think there was probably a better way to handle that I didn't love it but it is what it is I'm going to guess that you probably can't put him on a different path. Uh, he's probably always going to seek that revenge, right? Like, he's always going to be, like, more renegade. It's not, uh, like, a Garrus situation. Especially because he is a deal to seek companion. But I'm glad we saved the, the people there. Or I think we saved the... Yeah, surely we did. I know I didn't go to those other two doors, but surely we saved the people there. It definitely gave me some insight to Saeed. I cannot believe he's the founder of the Blue Suns. The elusive man had to know that, right? That's not new information. Why wouldn't he tell me that? That doucher withholds so much information and he lies so much. And there's like, there's probably like a grain of truth in everything he says and then the rest of it's a lie. I don't know. <laughs> Lots of stuff happened this episode. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for watching. I always have a good time doing this. I do get sad, but you know what? There's a lot of really fun moments too. I cannot believe I got dumped. Dump. You dumped Shepard. Look at her. He's missing out. <laughs> but next time we'll do, maybe we'll go recruit Tolly. That would be so much fun. So, until then.